Hey guys, welcome to Boarding Adventure. Here are Sia and Abi, and today we are spending a day at Cape Cod in Massachusetts. Cape Cod is some one and a half to two hours away from Boston and is a well-known summer destination in New England, where crowds flock from all the neighboring states to enjoy great beaches, laid-back lifestyle, food and wine, varied landscapes, hikes, and stunning sunrises and sunsets. Our first stop is Town Neck Beach and here we are at the Sandwich Boardwalk. Undoubtedly, our favorite part of Cape Cod, Sandwich has all the different fun activities. You could spend an entire day picnic, catch some fish or crab, spot birds or just the good old lay on the beach. So guys, as you could see, there was a lot of inland water from the ocean and the entire place was covered in grass. The boardwalk is so scenic. We could see people kayaking, water tubing and playing in the mud. There was also a beach on the calmer waters. So it's a must, must visit place and you definitely have to do it when in Cape Cod. Here we are at the cute little town of Chatham in the center of Cape Cod. Make sure you visit the Chatham Lighthouse, the adjoining beach. We also dined at the Wild Goose Tavern and visited an art display next to the restaurant. We had crabby salmon for lunch, the food was flavorful and just the kind we expected from the seafood haven Cape Cod. Here we are at the Cape Cod National Seashore and there's a $25 entrance fee to this area if you do not have the NPS annual pass. We are here for the Norset Lighthouse as you can see behind me there's a beach and also a short trail to the Three Sisters Lighthouse.
A short walk away was the Three Sisters Lighthouse. More importantly, we recommend taking a short drive along the ocean to the Coast Guard beach for riding bikes on the boardwalk over the marsh. Cape Cod Winery and Truro Vineyards are the places to go for some wine tasting. Very close to Provincetown is the Dunes Shack Trail which is a one mile long path over the white sand dunes with amazing views at sunset. Having this unique experience in a beach town, we further headed to the tip of Cape Cod to Race Point Beach for sunset. Post sunset, we wandered the streets of happening and popular province town, loaded with art alleys, souvenir shops, bars and restaurants. It was a perfect place for an evening stroll. We had dinner at highly rated lobster pot restaurant. The food was delicious. We had the Portuguese fish. The serving was huge and we ate to our heart's delight. For dessert, make sure to try the sought after Lewis Brothers ice cream. After doing some bar hopping and taking a peek into the nightlife of Provincetown, we headed back. And that brings an end to our Cape Cod trip. Make sure to check our other videos from Massachusetts and New England. And if you enjoy our vlogs, please do like this video and subscribe to our channel. Also, don't forget to hit the bell icon to never miss an upload at Boating Adventure.